Life is moving faster than ever. So get big savings on blazing speed with Cable One Internet Services. They're high speed and hassle-free. Just a few quick clicks and you're online and on budget with a super fast connection that blows the doors off dial-up and leaves DSL in the dust. Explore the web with Cable One Internet. It's always on, always fast, always easy with prices starting at $20 a month. Don't wait another minute. Call now. Here with Duck and Coach Jim Holloway for the Week 11 show. Feels good to be talking in Week 11. Coach. Well, it, it really, I don't know who's excited, me, me or you. I tell you, what, <laughs> uh, you know, it is fun. You know, anytime you get your football team in the playoffs, uh, uh, you know, you have to be pleased, you know, because ever, everybody, it's all starting over. 16 teams, 16 teams that want to win a state championship. So, you know, no matter how you finished your season up, whether you were First, second, third, or fourth place in your district, uh, you know, you're in the playoffs and have an opportunity to, to play for, for a championship. Well, we are coming off a Week 10 game that was a very physical, very tightly played game. I'll tell you what, I saw a lot of friends that, that I haven't seen in a couple of years, and they just wanted to come see a good football game. And, you know, we, we had people in the stands uh, that, that didn't even go watch their home team play, that, that showed up and watched this ball game but because they knew what it was going to be. And, uh, you know, it was a great football game. I'm sure if you were in the stands to watch, and uh, you know, it was a tough loss for us. Uh, but I, I think that we put ourselves in a position now that, that we know that, uh, you know, we can compete with the very best teams. And, you know, I think we've grown up quite a bit uh, during the course of the season. And, and I was really proud of the way that we prepared. We took all that preparation, took it right to the game field and fought hard till the end. So you can't ask for anything else. You know, you look back and, you just see so many missed opportunities. And it's a growing process, as you say, and that's the sort of thing you need to catch on, especially with the playoffs. Here. Well, and that's right, you know, and, you know, after visiting with the team, uh, you know, after the game on Friday, on the field, in the locker room, talking to the players, and then Monday, addressing the team, uh, first thing before Monday's practice, you know, we, we, we talked about those things, you know. Let's learn from it. Let's don't put ourselves in a position because we don't execute in the kicking game, that, that field position that just takes us out of everything that we want to do. Uh, you know, let's don't put ourselves in a position to have to go for it on fourth down. Let's execute on third down, you know. If it gets to fourth down, let's let's turn the heat up there a little bit. So, you know, I, I think that, that for us to take the next step, that's what we've got to do. Against a good football team, we've got to make more plays. This week, we're taking on a Guthrie team that you're going to be seeing more of in the upcoming years. Well, that's right. You know, we're, we're going to uh, see Guthrie next year in game one. Actually, we're going to open up the season of the next two years with Guthrie. And, uh, you know, they've got a young football team too, Michael. They, they're a lot like we are. You know, they graduated a good senior class and lost a lot of really good players. You know, their program for the last eight years has, has been really, really good, you know. Uh, you know, they won state championships. They've been in the finals. They've been in the semifinals several times. And, uh, but they graduated several players, much like we did. They started off the season with a freshman quarterback. Now he's in his 11th game. He's no longer a freshman. Uh, and that's the way they are at a lot of different positions, much like we are. It's almost a carbon copy. Uh, the two teams, the, you know, with what we started with, the lack of experience, what's been done, who we've been beaten by, their losses are a Shawnee. Many people think they're the best team in the state. They're undefeated. They lost to Carl Albert, who I think is the best team right now, and they lost to El Reno, who I think's got to be right there with Carl Albert. So, and then they lost to McGinnis in game one, 12 to seven. So, you know, they they've got a good football team. Uh, they're well coached. They have a lot of tradition, and, and you know, a, a first round exit from the playoffs not what they had planned either. Well, you're talking about similarities, and they are similar us in approach and the way they do their as you call preseason schedule, loading up on top teams and coming out of the bat, challenging themselves. Well, I, I think it's something that you have to do, and uh, Coach Watkins uh, 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 has been around long enough now, and being in that program and knowing where the program has to go, you know, in order to, to play in big games and play for district championships, state championships, you got to play good people, and, and uh, you know, he, he knows that recipe. Last week was had that playoff type atmosphere against Sarino. How much does that benefit to all this week? Well, I, I think I think it really carries over. I, I think the practice preparation uh, very similar. 
you know, you know, last week district championship, first round of the playoffs. You know, you got to get geared up against good football team. I think it helps your coaches. I think it helps the players. And then as we come out of the locker room this week, you know, we we come out of the locker room, uh, you know, the previous week and probably the biggest game of the year, and, and now. This Friday is the biggest game of the year, so we've come out of the locker room, you know, under the same circumstances again. I think for a young football team, two weeks in a row, well, that's fine. Last week, a very physical game. Got banged up a little bit, but everybody's back for you. Yeah, we had, we had everybody on the practice field on Monday, and, you know, uh, a couple of guys a little bit sore, but it was a hard-hitting football game. Coach Cobble said they were beat to a pulp, and, uh, you know, that it just, you know, it just shows you, you know, when two good defenses play each other, there's going to be a lot of people bunged up. One of the things that really stuck out to me is y'all's ability to keep Jaquil Everhart in check most of the night. Oh, I'll tell you what, fantastic defensive preparation, fantastic execution. You know, he had the 32-yard run there on, what, the fifth or sixth play of the ball game. He ended up with only 26 yards rushing. So from that point on, he had minus six yards. Uh, we just did a great job. I mean, we contained him uh, exactly like the, the blueprint that we drew up. And, you know, you just can't say enough about the kids, you know. And, you know, he slipped a lot of tackles. And, you know, we had the opportunity to sack him two or three other times and couldn't do it because he, he's Houdini. I'll tell you that. He is an unbelievable uh, uh, quarterback in the fact that he can – he can just make so many people miss tackles and make you look so bad. And you know, maybe a guy that had never seen a football game said, "Boy, those guys can't tackle." Well, I'm telling you what, you, you can't tackle the wind. I'm telling you, it's it's a tough chore. Well, one thing that really sticks out to me in your five years here is you have this habit of making the playoffs every odd year. Well, I hadn't even thought about that. And I hope <laughs> next year's 2011. Yeah. Well, guys, we appreciate okay. you. Thank you very much. Life is moving faster than ever, so get big savings on blazing speed with Cable One Internet Services. They're high speed and hassle free. Just a few quick clicks and you're online and on budget with a super fast connection that blows the doors off dial up and leaves DSL in the dust. Explore the web with Cable One Internet. It's always on, always fast, always easy with prices starting at $20 a month. Don't wait another minute. Call now.